I mean, I think from a results standpoint, it's great, obviously. A um, little disappointed about the one we let in. I think that we can do better on that. Um, you know, but to come out uh, a little rusty, not everyone has played together for that long. Um, Kim uh, and Rich, of course, he just got in the other day, just got in uh, just early last week. So I think from, from that kind of standpoint and putting everyone together, we're happy with the win. I still think we need to, um, I mean, obviously have better performance. Um, still kind of you can tell we're just a little bit off um, in some ways, but I think a few more games under our belt will be starting to click. And then I'll be leaving, so <laughs> then I'll come back. <laughs> then it'll be okay. No, no, it's okay. Yeah, absolutely. Um, huge effort from everyone. Uh, I thought that uh, everyone that started and played, everyone that came off the bench, um, energy from our bench and the energy from the crowd was awesome. Uh, I don't think you can ask for more uh, in terms of that and trying to, trying to stick to the game plan and trying to kind of cut out the things that we knew that they would try. I mean, obviously with um, Sydney up top, trying to cut out that long ball as much as possible and just making sure that we're attentive to that. I think she only really got through one time on that collision. Uh, the second half so I feel like we did a good job on that um, and just overall I think everyone's just buzzing to be back out again yeah 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 it's uh that's sort of that's the business I guess of it um, it's unfortunate um, she, she was fun to have around here and didn't want it to have to happen that way but um, that's life and you know moved on and you know we had a good result today and we're happy about that Coaches sometimes talk about the danger of a two goal lead and family out. Yeah. It's like a switch turned on and you had a 13 minute half. Yeah. <laughs> Could you talk a little bit about how that maybe kind of affected the last few minutes? Yeah, I felt that a little bit. Um, they came out in the second half, changed the formation, uh, made a change, and they. I wouldn't say they totally got going, but they started to have a little bit more possession, and then they got that goal, and then you could, you know, just kind of feel like they were coming and they were dangerous. They were getting down the flanks a little bit. So I think it was huge. It was a great, uh, I guess, sort of response from us to come back um, and to put some goals in. Um, some great counterattacks. Bev had a great counter. I think two, two or three of the goals came from came from really good counterattacks, just quicking out and, and great decision making. So. Obviously, if you can score a hat trick in that amount of time, you do. I was just saying to the girls, I don't think I've had a hat trick since I was like 12. Never won as a pro, so um, it was fun to have that be my first game. Hopefully, you can remember when you just said it was the last first time you said it. Was it the fastest you think you scored? Yeah, I think so. I think so. I used to play uh, much more like center striker when I was younger, so I would have about 15 chances and score three, so this was a little bit better conversion rate for me. Can we look forward to seeing more of this season? I think so. Um, I mean, I don't, I don't think it'll always be easy, but I think that that's the way that we like to play. Um, I think that's that's this club. You know, we put work in all off season, and you know, the the whole staff um, and the coaching staff do an incredible job, just super professional all the time. Um, and getting us prepared and I think that we love playing here and we love playing in front of this crowd and we love playing for this club behind this badge um, that means a lot to us and that that propels us out on the field um, and then getting all of us back together I think there's a lot of like-minded players out there who who kind of think the same way on the field and so you have that connection and you have kind of that that little buzzing energy that's always under the surface and I think um, getting us back in and get a few games under our belt and obviously especially there's gonna be a little break in there but you know finishing out the season I, I hope that we can just build on last season and um, keep going from where we were last season and hopefully finish with a better result. How do you have three goals today? Which one is the most uh, I think the last one is my most favorite. Yeah, I thought that was uh, the most intricate. I mean, the first one was a great ball by Merritt. She did a really good job um, going on the outside and getting that cross off. Um, I haven't scored a header goal in a long time either. <laughs> Definitely not two in one game. Um, but yeah, I think the last one was a beautiful little chip over the top by Jess. Um, that was a great goal, I think.